An ugly start to the game wouldn't end up mattering one bit, because in March it's simply survive and advance, and that's what the Beavers did on Saturday, when they knocked off Loyola Chicago, 65-58, to advance to the Elite Eight of the 2021 NCAA Tournament. The trip to the Final Eight will be the program's first since 1982, a vacated run by the NCAA, or 1966, if you prefer to play by stricter policies. Regardless, the Beavers advancing is simply another amazing step for a team picked to finish 12th in the conference's preseason poll. Oregon State is now just the second 12th seed ever to make the Elite Eight in NCAA tournament history. In Saturday's win over Loyola Chicago, it was Ethan Thompson once again who led the way, as he tallied 21 points, 4 assists and 4 rebounds, including a 7-for-7 seven seven day from the free throw line. In the game, the senior guard also passed legend A.C. Green on the program's all-time scoring list. Helping Thompson was forward Warath Aladish, who added a 10-point, 11-rebound double-double, and clutch shooter Jared Lucas, who knocked down two crucial three-pointers en route to finishing with eight points. Oregon State was also aided by a much-needed 15-8 bench points advantage, as nine different players for the Beavers found their way into the scoring column. For Loyola Chicago, star forward Cameron Crutwig finished with 14 points and 10 rebounds, while guard Lucas Williamson added 10 points and 7 rebounds and Braden Norris chipped in 10 points and 6 assists. First half The first half would not be one described by basketball critics as a work of art, in any way, as both teams shot a combined 12 for 47 from the field and added 11 turnovers, including the Ramblers finishing the first 20 minutes with one less field goal than giveaway. 4 FGs, 5 twos. Overall, Loyola Chicago shot 17% from the field and went 1-9 from behind the arc in a truly dreadful shooting display. They also failed to score in the final 452 of the period, fueling an 11-0 run by the Beavers. The Ramblers also struggled with foul trouble, as starters Lucas Williamson, R. Uguak and Keith Clemsons all had at least two knocks against them. While big man Cameron Crutwig was solid with 6 points on a 3-5 shooting performance, his teammates were just 1-18 against the Beavers' increasingly more used zone defense, that held head coach Porter Moser's team to just 16 points at the break, the lowest in any half this season for Loyola Chicago. As for the Beavers, Oregon State received 10 points from star talent Ethan Thompson in the first frame and a surprise 9 points from their bench unit, including 4 points, 2-3 FG, from Rodrigue Andela, a notable omission from their last round win over Oklahoma State, and a three-pointer from Tarek Silver. They also received a beautiful buzzer beater on a great jump stop lay-in from forward Warath Aladish, which brought even more positive momentum into the locker room for the Beavers.